Hey Wolf, this is going on everyone, this is Wicked and today I will show you a video which I promised to make a couple of weeks ago and I'm talking about my top 5 Wicked Expose modules working on Samsung Galaxy S8 or S8 Plus. Of course, if you want to try these you'll need Expose Framework. I did a video about how to install it and I'll leave a card right next to my video if you want to check it out. I'm currently running Android 7.0 on Renovate iOS 5.1 along with official Expose Framework version 88.1. So. Without further ado, let's get wicked. So, the first module which I absolutely use the most is called Xinsta. With this application, you will be able to customize and utilize the Instagram app at a whole new level. You have various settings to choose from, like selecting a color for a user to see if he or she is following you, setting a download location for various downloading items like uh, pictures, stories, videos and so on and so forth. As you can see, if I open up Instagram and go to a picture or video, when I press the options button it will show me a download section right below all the menus already available. Also in the stories lineup there is no time limit so you can watch the picture or video for as long as you want and of course also be able to download it. On videos I have also activated the option to show me the likes and views not just the views as they are displayed by default and when you open up a profile if uh, the user follows you the app will display the number of people he or she follows in a different color so you can see if she follows you right on the screen. The second wicked module I use the most is the YouTube background playback. This is really useful in my perspective especially if YouTube Red is not available in your country. You can listen to your music with YouTube running in the background without any miss. The module will also give you a notification thread where you can pause play the next video or kill the app just like a normal music player. In my opinion this is a module you should always have on your device if you're watching lots of YouTube videos and if you're already on my video right now I guess you're that type of person so go download it. By the way links to the modules I listed as always in the description. The next module will improve your battery life a lot. It is called Smart Network and will let you choose between which network modes you want your phone to run while having Wi-Fi turned on or off for example. This is what I use this module for. When my Wi-Fi is turned off, the phone will automatically switch to 4G, 3G or 2G mode so that I can benefit of a full network speeds on my mobile data. When you turn Wi-Fi back on, you won't really need high speed mobile data and you can save Hell of a lot of battery by changing the network mode to 2G, a mode which is less battery than 4G for example. Well this module does that automatically for you. Of course you'll have Bluetooth, NFC, GPS specific parameters but I mainly use this only for network modes regarding my Wi-Fi state. Now into the fourth module I use the most, SoundCloud Downloader. I don't have unlimited data and uh, what if I need to leave the Wi-Fi zone and get uh, to my car for a short trip for example. I get bored with the same music again and again and with this module I can easily search for a deep house mix on SoundCloud and easily download it with high speed download rate in no time before I leave and then listen to it later without having to waste any mobile data. That's a really great module for audioholics and since SoundCloud is such a big music environment this is a really nice module to have. The last but not the least module is Adblocker Reborn. Well, this is constantly running for me and as the title says it blocks all the ads on your device. You're good to go after you install it and activate it, you don't need to customize anything in the app even though it offers you a user interface and uh, won't let you notice a thing when you're browsing apps with ads, Instagram ads and so on and so forth. I agree with the idea of ads, but in the last period of time they got more and more intrusive and that's why I decided to disable them with this module. Anyways, this was the video for today, I hope you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and activate the bell icon so that you'll be notified with all my uploads. I'm Wicked and you can find me on Twitter and Instagram at Let's Get Wicked and on Google Plus at Wicked is here. If you like my video, don't forget to press that thumbs up button. As always, until next time, take care. Wicked is out. Bye bye.